Growing fear here in Michigan where marijuana is legal that kids have easy access to the drug, sometimes thinking that edibles are candy. And for young people, a big dose of dope can be deadly. Here's Donovan Long now with a look at a new solution out of Barry County. This is an airtight way health leaders are hoping limits some exposure to marijuana. It was a really great way to protect our communities. The Barry Eaton District Health Department is calling this protector a lockbox. Workers say all 76 of them at their facility are state funded. They are giving them to families to use as a safe space for their weed. And the lockboxes are really just to, you know, promote safety. Health leaders say the lockboxes are a part of the department's harm reduction campaign. Keep marijuana locked up and away from children. Aimed at keeping vulnerable kids, adults, and pets from exposure to cannabis. Was there a problem in the community that you felt like you had to solve by offering these lockboxes? Since recreational marijuana use and medical marijuana use has increased over the years, um, there have been increased calls to poison control centers um, for children and pets. Spectrum Health doctors say they too are seeing a huge spike in the number of kids showing up to the hospital with symptoms suggesting they've consumed marijuana. It's not a pleasant feeling for them, um, so they kind of wax and wane between agitation and honestly looking unconscious. Doctors' biggest worry, edibles that can look to kids like candy. It's also understanding that if a two-year-old eats all the gummies in the package, that is a potentially lethal overdose for that two-year-old. While the effects of exposure is still being studied, health workers say they know marijuana impacts an adult and child's brain differently. That's why they want adults to use this safe haven for this substance. Make good decisions. Reporting in Grand Rapids, Donovan Long, News 8.